All right, today we will be taking apart a Dell Inspiron 17-7000 series laptop with the touchscreen. This particular model is a 17-7778. And we will be using a 2.5 millimeter Phillips head screwdriver. So first we wanna go ahead and just remove all of these screws on the bottom cover. And then once you get all the screws out, you can go ahead and pop the bottom cover assembly off. You might have a few um, little catch tabs around the outside, but they will pop off. Then you will have access to the internals of the laptop. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do, of course, is to disconnect the battery. And most of the screws in here are a little bit smaller size than the back cover, so I switched it to a 2.0 Phillips bit. So, we'll go ahead and disconnect the battery by pulling the connector straight back and straight out. And go ahead and remove the screws. And we can go ahead and lift the battery out. All right, next we can do the hard drive. So we'll go ahead and just lift up on the SATA connector. And then we can remove the two, three screws holding in the hard drive caddy. You can lift out the hard drive and then remove the hard drive. Two screws on either side. All right, next we can do the Wi-Fi card. Remove the screw with the retainer and then pull straight up on the antennas to remove them and pull the card straight out. All right, we can do the memory. So spread the retainer bars and then pull the memory stick out. All right, next we can do the uh, USB SD card board over here. So we're gonna go ahead and remove the ribbon from the motherboard first. So let's pull, go ahead and pull that little tape out and then the connector is retained by a little bar right here. So you just flip that up with your fingernail and pull straight out on the connector and that will free it from the motherboard. Looks like there's a couple connectors over here. So we're gonna get least looks like the pram battery actually so we can go ahead and unstick that and then remove the screws and the in in our board should come straight out with the pram battery All right, next we can do the power button. And CPU cooling fan, so connector, you can just straight out using your fingernails on those little tabs. 
from the case and then undo the screws. Alright, next we can do the DC jack. Alright, now we can remove the heatsink. Um, the screws are numbered, but that's for installation, so just remove all the screws for the heatsink and then it should. Uh, Come right off the motherboard. It's only important to follow the numbers during installation so that you tighten it down evenly. All right, so this one has a discrete graphics card, so we're gonna go ahead and remove that one next. So we're gonna disconnect it from the motherboard and leave the little ribbons with the graphics card. All right, so after you take the screws out, just lift it up um, gently with your fingernail or a straight edge tool and then remove the screws. All right, now let's go ahead and uh, remove the motherboard. So we're gonna wanna make sure we've removed all of the ribbons and connectors that are connecting the motherboard to the rest of the laptop. So we'll go ahead and just remove all the ribbons all the way around. Once you have everything visible unplugged, you can go ahead and remove the screws for the motherboard. Once you've got all the visible screws, you can free the motherboard and just gently flip it over. And make sure that there's no ribbons connected to the bottom. All right, now we can go ahead and separate the assemblies, the display assembly and the palm rest assembly. Just go ahead and open up the laptop and then we can go ahead and remove the hinge screws and then separate the two halves.
right, so what we're left with is the uh, palm rest assembly. Uh, you have tons of screws here to remove the keyboard, including this metal backing plate. Um, touch pad is just a few screws here, and the speakers are just kind of held in by little rubber grommets. So that's the inside of the palm rest assembly. All right, for the display assembly, um, just have the bezel and the back cover um, separated by color on this model. So you want to get a little flat edge in between those two pieces. And you just work your way around until the two pieces separate. It's going to be the back cover. Um, this back cover coming off of the rest of the assembly. There's the inside of the laptop. Um, looks like it's just a, maybe a couple screws to um, remove the fucking dog. Jesus. Okay, now to take apart the display assembly, you're just gonna separate the two halves, the silverback cover from the front bezel, and the front bezel is what uh, kind of holds onto the screen. So just get a flat edge in between the silver back cover and the black bezel. And then you should be able to separate the two halves. So you got your webcam, display cable, and then the screen assembly, and then the electronics there at the bottom, and then the inside of the back cover, you can just undo your uh, hinge screws to remove the hinges, and then you have your Wi-Fi. All right, so that's how you disassemble a Dell Inspiron 7000. 17-inch um, 7000 series. If this video helped you or you like it, please uh, like and subscribe. Thank you.